Well, we are learning more details about what exactly happened here. The superintendent of the East Haven School District did send out an email to parents early this morning addressing what happened. Now, they did mention the fact that that person that was assaulted with the knife is not from East Haven. So we do know that so far. I also was just able to spoke with, speak with police, and they say that they will be releasing new information about what exactly happened here around the next hour or two. But what we do know so far is that around 630 yesterday, Yesterday evening, officers were called here to Tuttle Elementary School to respond to an altercation involving several people. They tell us when officers arrived, they found one minor with injuries. Although they haven't said what the extent of the injuries is, they said that the boy was attacked with a knife during the altercation. Officers say he was treated here on scene and then taken to a New Haven hospital. We are still waiting for an update on his condition. Neighbors tell me middle school aged kids often hang out behind the school where the altercation happened, saying there is a basketball court and a playground that have become popular for after hours. Now that school did again send an email to parents this morning addressing the situation, saying that this was quote an isolated incident and they are working with police to figure out why exactly this happened and how this happened. Again, we are hoping to speak with police here shortly. Now neither the name nor the age of that uh, minor has been released at this time, which is often the case in situations involving somebody under the age of 18. We are still working to learn more information, but they say that there is nobody in danger at this time. They are just having an extra police presence here to make sure that everybody feels peace of mind and stays safe. Live in East Haven, Brooke Griffin, Fox 61, Connecticut's News Station.